part of the Google Books project to Google has digitized uh, newspaper archives going well back into the 1800s at least and you can now search that directly from the Google News homepage. Go to uh, news.google.com, click on the uh, arrow here to advanced news search, enter your search terms, let's try something like uh, Lincoln, assassination, and you want to search uh, in the archive or a specific date. In this case, uh, I think it happened uh, sometime in 1865, but I'm not sure, so I'm going to do this. And go ahead and hit search. Sure enough, it's bringing back uh, scanned in news articles uh, from that period of time. Uh, this one from the morning Freeman has made an impression on me in the past, so I'm going to click that. What you get is an image of the newspaper uh, with your search terms highlighted in context. You want to move around the page as well and distort, uh, explore other highlights. <coughs> this particular paragraph here uh, really illustrates to me why this is powerful uh, in an educational context because students will get an entirely different sort of uh, perspective on this assassination than they would uh, in a textbook uh, or in a other uh, accounts on the web. Uh, and it will talk a lot about uh, how they discovered uh, Lincoln's uh, wound and how he was babbling uh, incoherently. Course, eventually is, is uh, unconscious, and, and his wife is, is uh, screaming at him in this paragraph to live, and live but for one moment to speak to me once more, live to speak to our children. Oh, bring our Tad, she calls out, for he loves Tad so well I know he will keep him. Uh, and uh, when you read passages like this, uh, you can have a pretty different uh, perspective on, on these assassinations, and I think on assassinations in general. <coughs>